Welcome to this edition of Ethical Sustainable Investment News and Analysis to Profit By. I'm Ron Robbins, an ethical investing pioneer for over 40 years, quoted in the Wall Street Journal, Market Watch, The Globe and Mail, and numerous other media, and founder of the highly respected global ethical sustainable investing information website, Investing for the Soul. And please listen to my disclosure, disclaimer statement at the end of this podcast. Now enjoy this podcast. Hello, Ron Robbins here. So welcome to my podcast episode 107 titled Best ESG Stocks to Buy for 2023. It's presented by Investing for the Soul. Investingforthesoul.com is your site for vital global ethical and sustainable investing mentoring, news, commentary, information and resources. And look at my newly totally revised website at investingforthesoul.com. Uh, I might be having a few technical issues with it, but please <laughs> bear along with it. Thank you. Um, so remember that you can find a full transcript and links to content, including stock symbols and bonus material, on this episode's podcast page located at investingforthesoul.com forward slash podcasts. Now, if any terms are unfamiliar to you, simply Google them. Also, a reminder, I do not evaluate any of the stocks or funds mentioned in these podcasts, nor do I receive any compensation from anyone covered in these podcasts. Furthermore, I will reveal to you any personal investments I have in the investments mentioned herein. Additionally, quotes about individual companies are brief, so that I can get as many companies covered as possible in the time allowed. Please go to this podcast web page for links to the actual articles for more company and stock information. Also, some companies might be covered more than once, and there are also three article links below that time didn't allow me to review them here. I'm starting this podcast with this article titled, Top 5 Picks for the Best ESG Stocks to Buy in 2023. Sustainable Investment Funds. It's by and found on industryleadersmagazine.com. Here are their picks with some quotes on each of them. 1. Verisk Analytics Inc. has a very clear ESG policy that has previously helped it achieve the third rank out of 100 companies. The company caters data and risk management solutions to the financial industry. Analysts believe that for risk analytics dominates a monopoly in the property and casualty insurance market. 2. Microsoft Corporation The largest and most popular software company in the world, Microsoft Corporation has a variety of segments in cloud computing, digital infrastructure, and personal computing. The company has committed to transforming into carbon negative by 2030. 3. Adobe Adobe has been a dominant player in digital content creation, software, publishing, and cloud storage with its flagship Photoshop software. Marketing analytics tools for business and subscriptions to premium Adobe software make for a brimming multi-billion revenue stream. With the global gender pay parity, Adobe's half income is owed to renewable sources with goals of a 100% attainment by 2035. 3. NVIDIA Corporation NVIDIA manufactures graphics processing units, GPUs, for the gaming sector. The company is positioned at strongholds in supercomputers, AI, autonomous cars, and gaming. 
This is one of the best ESG companies to invest in. 4. J.B. Hunt Transport Services, Inc. Primarily operates in the trucking and rail carrier segments of the United States. J.B. Hunt has been increasing its dividend payment in recent years. End quotes. Now an article in a segment that most ethical and sustainable investors would consider. The article is titled 12 Best Software Infrastructure Stocks to Buy by Fahid Salim and found on finance.yahoo.com. Here are some quotes by Mr. Salim on each of his picks. Starting with number 12, Hewlett Packard Enterprise Company. Number of hedge fund holders, 37. Hewlett Packard Enterprise Company provides software defined infrastructure, that SDI, solutions for businesses to help them manage their networking, storage, automation, and overall software development and deployment. 11 is Zscaler Inc. Hedge fund holders, 38. Zscaler focuses on the security side of software infrastructure since it's primarily a cloud security company. It's known for its cloud infrastructure modernization solution called the Zscaler Zero Trust Exchange. Zscaler also provides infrastructure as code services to provide cloud security. 10. Splunk Inc. Hedge Fund Holders 49 Splunk Inc. is known for its infrastructure monitoring solutions that help businesses see their systems back end in real time, detect and resolve solutions. 9. International Business Machines Corp. or IBM Hedge Fund Holders 49 IBM is the biggest provider of infrastructure as a service solutions. IBM provides consultancy and deployment solutions related to cloud infrastructure storage, networking, AI infrastructure deployment, among other services. 8 is Cisco Systems Inc. Hedge Fund Holders 61. Cisco Systems provides various solutions for software infrastructure related to virtualization, networking, data centers, performance optimization, and more. It is one of the oldest and strongest players in the industry. 7. Oracle Corporation Hedge Fund Hoarders 67 Oracle Corporation is a one-stop shop for software infrastructure solutions and services. The Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, OCI, provides complete solutions for cloud deployment, including services related to servers, storage, network, applications and services. 6. VMware Inc. Hedge Fund Holders 68. VMware provides various solutions for software infrastructure deployment and management, including desktop hypervisor solutions, cloud infrastructure solutions for Azure, AWS and other cloud platforms, cloud automation and more. 5. CrowdStrike Holdings Inc. Hedge Fund Holders 72. Cyber security and cloud services company CrowdStrike Holdings provides infrastructure as code, IAC, cloud infrastructure and infrastructure monitoring services. IAC includes automating infrastructure provisioning, deployment, configuration and management, orchestrating infrastructure components, configuring and monitoring all systems. 4. Palo Alto Networks Inc. Hedge Fund Holders 87. Palo Alto Networks provides cloud security services that help businesses protect their software infrastructure. Palo Alto Networks Inc.'s cloud NGFW solutions 
allows easy deployment of firewalls on cloud platforms. 3. ServiceNow Inc. Hedge Fund Hoarders 96. ServiceNow provides products and solutions that help businesses keep a smooth flow of operations. ServiceNow Inc.'s services allow cloud monitoring, IT management, automated deployment of software, easy integrations and more. And number two is Amazon.com Inc. Hedge Fund Hoarders 243. Amazon dominates the cloud markets. It provides software infrastructure solutions and services to small and large businesses. In the first quarter, Amazon Web Services revenue jumped 16% on a year-over-year -year basis to $21.4 billion. Amazon recently announced that it plans to invest a massive $12.7 billion in cloud infrastructure in India. And number one, Microsoft Corporation, again. <laughs> Hedge Fund Hoarders, 289. Microsoft Corporation is the second biggest player in the cloud market. As of the end of the first quarter, Microsoft Corporation's market share in the cloud markets stands at 23%, much higher than Alphabet Inc. Most importantly, Microsoft Azure grew faster than Amazon Web Services in the first quarter. End quotes. And back to a favorite sector with this article titled Best Green Stocks to Invest in. In-depth analysis by Yaka and seen on CryptoSoho.com. Yaka has this to say about his picks. Note, just brief comments by Yaka are included here. 1. Tesla. Tesla, the electric vehicle giant, is widely regarded as a compelling investment for several reasons. Market leadership, technological innovation, sustainable energy ecosystem, gigafactories and production capacity, global market potential, network of superchargers and infrastructure, and strong financial performance. Number two is NIO Inc. NIO is a Chinese electric vehicle manufacturer specializing in premium electric SUVs. They have gained popularity for their innovative designs, advanced autonomous driving capabilities, and battery swapping technology. Number three, General Motors Company. General Motors offers a range of EVs, including the Chevrolet Bolt EV and the upcoming GMC Hummer EV. 4. SunPower Corporation SunPower is a leading solar energy company that designs, manufactures and sells high-performance solar panels and associated solar energy solutions. In addition to solar panel manufacturing, SunPower offers installation, maintenance and monitoring solutions to ensure optimal performance and customer satisfaction. Business advantages of investing in SunPower Corporation, vertical integration, strong brand recognition, diverse geographic presence, and focus on energy storage. Number five, Beyond Meat Inc. Beyond Meat produces plant-based burgers, sausages, and other meat alternatives that closely resemble the taste and texture of animal-based meat products. Beyond Meat's products are made from plant proteins, such as peas and soy, and have gained popularity among consumers seeking plant-based options. Number six, Impossible Foods Inc. But this is a private company, so I don't know why it's listed here, but anyway. Impossible Foods is another leading plant-based meat company that specializes in creating realistic meat substitutes. Their flagship product, the Impossible Burger, is made from plant ingredients 
including soy protein and hemma, which give it a meat-like flavour and texture. Number 7. Oatly AB Oatly is a Swedish company that produces a range of plant-based dairy alternatives, primarily based on oats. They offer oat milk, oat-based ice cream, yogurt and other oat-based products. Oatly focuses on sustainable production practices and aims to provide consumers with delicious, environmentally friendly alternatives to traditional dairy products. End quotes. And now to a best-loved industry with this article titled Top 10 Renewable Energy Companies by Lucy Buchholz found on sustainabilitymag.com Here are some of her comments on each company. Number 10. Canadian Solar Inc. Market cap, US $2.74 billion. Canadian Solar specializes in the design and manufacturing of solar photovoltaic modules while offering comprehensive energy solutions. The company undertakes the management of solar power projects and provides operation and maintenance services. Canadian Solar serves customers spanning more than 160 countries. 9. Plug Power Inc. Market cap $8.18 billion. Founded in 1997 and headquartered in Latham, New York, Plug Power has grown to become a significant player in the hydrogen fuel cell industry. 8. Brookfield Renewable Partners Market cap $5.16 billion Brookfield Renewable Partners operates renewable power facilities worldwide. The company's electricity generation comes from a diverse range of sources including hydroelectric, wind, solar, distributed generation, pumped storage, cogeneration, and biomass. 7. Algonquin Power and Utilities Market cap $5.2 billion Based in Oakville, Ontario, Canada, Algonquin Power and Utilities delivers regulated utility services and renewable energy solutions to a customer base exceeding 1 million across North America. The company actively invests in a diverse range of clean and renewable energy sources, including solar power, wind energy, hydroelectric power, and thermal energy. Number 6. Siemens Gamesa. Market cap $12.97 billion. With a presence in over 90 countries, Siemens Gamesa offers a range of equipment and services related to onshore and offshore wind turbines, turbine gearboxes, and off-grid systems. Number 5. Vestas. Market cap, $29.58 billion. Based in Denmark, Vestas Wind Systems is a wind energy company that specializes in the design, manufacturing, and installation of wind turbines. With a global presence, the company has successfully deployed wind turbines in numerous countries worldwide by harnessing the collective expertise of 29,000 employees. And number four, Orsted AS, market cap $36.19 billion. Renewable energy company Orsted AS excels in the development, construction, and operation of offshore wind farms. The Danish company holds the prestigious title of being the world's largest developer of offshore wind power. And number three, Iberdrola SA, market cap $72.67 billion. Iberdrola SA is headquartered in Bilbao, Spain, It holds a prominent position as one of the largest utility providers globally. Iberdrola primarily engages in the generation, 
distribution and sale of electricity and boasts a diverse energy portfolio encompassing sources such as wind, hydro, nuclear and natural gas. And number two, Next Era Energy Inc. Market cap, $147.57 billion. Headquartered in Florida, Next Era Energy is one of the largest renewable energy producers in the world. By 2025, Next Era Energy aims to decrease its carbon dioxide emission rate by 67% in comparison to 2005 levels. And number one, General Electric, market cap $89.02 billion. The company has made significant strides in the development of green energy solutions and has emerged as a key player in the industry. GE's commitment to sustainability is reflected in its focus on renewable energy sources, particularly in the development of wind turbines. GE has also invested in other renewable energy technologies, including solar power and hydroelectricity. End quotes. Now some other honourable mentions, not in any particular order. 1. Title. Insiders show confidence in Hainan Armstrong Sustainable Infrastructure Capital with stock purchases despite stake reduction by California Public Employees Retirement System on beststocks.com by Elaine Mendonca. And number two title, Investing in iShares ESG Aware MSCI EAFE ETF, a unique edge in an ever-changing investment landscape on, again, beststocks.com by Yasmin Bidonka. And an article from Australia, title, Three ASX All Ordinary Shares I Don't Think Will Stay Cheap For Long on fool.com.au by Tristan Harrison. Well, these are my top news stories with their stock and fun tips for this podcast titled Best ESG Stocks to Buy for 2023. Now, please be sure to click the like and subscribe buttons on Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, or wherever you download or listen to this podcast. That helps bring these podcasts to others like you. And please click the share buttons to share this podcast with your friends and family. Let's promote ethical and sustainable investing as a force for hope and prosperity in these horribly troubled times. Contact me if you have any questions. Thank you for listening. Talk to you next on June 16th. And again, look at my totally new revised website at investingforthesoul.com. There might be a few teething issues, but uh, nonetheless, it's a great redevelopment uh, I'm proud of. Thank you. Uh, Tell me what you think. Bye for now. Learn how to create a simple portfolio reflecting your personal values by taking my one-hour tutorial. Go to investingforthesoul.com forward slash podcasts and click the link in the right-hand column for my DIY Ethical Sustainable Investing Pays tutorial. Now, I'll mention in the podcast if I have any direct interest or holdings in companies or securities I'm talking about. Furthermore, any news, opinions, analysis, or other information offered by myself, as well as references and information to or from other external sources in this podcast is provided as general market information and should not be relied upon and thus does not constitute investment advice. Investors should consult their own licensed investment professional before making investments. Also, I will not accept liability for any loss or damage, including without limitation any loss of profit which may arise directly or indirectly from use of or reliance on information in this podcast. Do contact me 
at Ron R at investingforthesoul.com. Signing off, this is Ron Robbins.